Ladies and gentlemen, hello, my ben Benji, my friend. Ladies and gentlemen, I am a big, big fan of Pink Floyd. And there was a man that created Pink Floyd called Sid Barrett. Not a lot of people know him because he went mad because he was very happy. And basically, he came to this university when he was a young man. And he was studying arts and crafts because obviously he's creative. To be a songwriter and a lead guitarist and a person that plays lead guitar makes you pretty much the main man. Ladies and gentlemen, Sid Barrett, the creator of Pink Floyd, was a student at this university 50 odd years ago. And guess what? He'd done his first ever gig on that balcony there. And I spoke to a man called Chris that works here. And Chris doesn't want to be filmed for whatever reason. But Chris said to me that apparently that whole balcony was full of speakers. I have spoken to an eyewitness that knows about Sid Barrett's first gig here. And they told me that Sid Barrett filled it up with speakers and musical equipment and played his first ever gig up there. How about that, ladies and gentlemen? Is that history? Sid Barrett, our hero, shine on to the Angular Ruskin University. Did I say that right? Yeah. Thank you, you beautiful people. That's Benji, and what's your name again? Abby. Abby. We have got some beautiful people here, and I can see how beautiful Sid is, because the people that are here today are as beautiful as what Sid was then. Beauty just doesn't leave Cambridge. Ladies and gentlemen, Sid Barrett, Pink Floyd's creator, done his first ever gig there. Maybe I'm going to shut up and let you look at it because it is just amazing. Sid Barrett, all around. Wow. I can feel him in this room. Can you not feel him, Abby, in the room? Can you not feel Sid Barrett here? Yeah. How did he get up there? Did he climb up? The question is, how did he get from here to the balcony? There must be stairs. Or maybe he elevated his mind because the music was so elevating. I guess he did. But Sid Barrett, he did. Ladies and gentlemen, he did play his first ever gig there. It is true. That is amazing that we got here. How many people go to this university, Abby? Is it a big one? Is it? Yeah. What, would you say like less than a thousand or? Oh no, more than that. More than, more than a thousand? Yeah, yeah. Wow. Abby is a lady that I met in the room where Sid Barrett played his first gig. Did you know Sid Barrett played his first gig here? I didn't. You did it, but you know now. Does it make you feel any different? <laughs> Thank you for letting me film you. You're a star. I've only got two viewers, so oh. no need to get shy. <laughs> But I'm hoping by the time we get old, it would have had 20 million, because not many people have seen where Sid Barrett played his first ever gig, ever. Yeah. And you go to this university, you didn't even know. So what hope has the world got? Abby, you're amazing. Lovely to meet you. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Sid Barrett played his first gig there. And that is amazing. <laughs>